Guys only want one thing. What it looks like. What it feels like. Being scared of going to college as a freshman for the first time. Making new friends at orientation and realizing that everyone is super nice. When you've been talking to your girlfriend on call 4 hours and you run out of topics, but you don't want to stop talking to her. I love you. My girlfriend texting me and telling me that she loves me. Me who just opened my phone to tell her the same. Fred slaps neighborhood. This baby can hold so many special, unique people, just like you. When she asks if you want to cuddle. I can do this all day. How he thinks he looks versus how I think he looks. When she asks if you want to feel the baby kicking. When you're extremely stressed, did you keep a positive attitude? Because you know this too shall pass. My mom. Smashing the wall for hurting me. 3 year old me. Ha ha die wall. Toddler me. Rambling about nonsense. My parents. Listening with great interest. When your adoptive mother is proud of you and boasts about you. I raised that boy. Me. Asking for more food after my grandma served me for 60th time. My grandma. Dad. Gets me a piano. 7 year old me, mashes random keys. Dad listening. When you buy nice things for your mother, as she has struggled her whole life to raise and shape you. You get what you freaking deserve. Mum telling me she doesn't want to eat ice cream. Me telling her I don't want to eat either, cause I know it's her favorite flavor and she is leaving it just for me. When you have made the best out of your day, and feel accomplished. In a piece. My girlfriend ordering food for me because of my social anxiety. Me. Thank you. 10 year old me crying. After I accidentally broke his phone. My dad telling me it's alright. Thank you for changing my life. I am literally you. I know. Thanks for not giving up. Being silent in the library because of the rules. Being silent in the library is a way to respect the librarians and help them do their job. Newborn baby says aged. Whole family. Positive attitude. Minor setback. Feel sorry for myself not having any friends. Start a new hobby and put myself out there. Studies for 5 minutes. Yo. This shoot's interesting. Goes on to top the class by studying regularly. Me. What does this mirror do, professor? It shows us nothing more or less than the deepest, most desperate desire of our hearts. Love and support from someone. When your broker's frick and your friend offers to pay for you, so that you can still hang out with the group. That was very cash money of you. Exercising so others will like how you look. Exercising so you like how you look. When nobody is responding to teacher's questions, so you help homie out. Me waiting for a text from my girlfriend. Me when I hear a text notification. When you saw a stray cat and thought that it'll attack. Instead, it cuddles to you and sits on your lap. Finally, in a piece. Rude customer. My manager standing up for me. Me, a newbie employee. 80 year old me hoping a nice family would adopt me. Me when they took me in, and treated me like their own. My mistakes. Me trying to do a little bit better every day. 
when you hang out with your friend and he says that he appreciates your company. Me with a time machine. Don't waste your best years living in doubt. You will find love and happiness. I promise. When your friend is using their past self to bring themselves down. Progress is progress. Me. Tell my grandpa something about my hobby. My grandpa who doesn't understand a word but still listens with interest. Me returning back to a game after years. The old save file with all my achievements. My metal friend. I hate Christmas. My metal friend when it's Christmas. My stepfather when I call him dad for the first time. How school feels when you're in it. How school feels after you graduate. Trying to accept someone's compliment. It feels weird but I'll allow it. Be an introvert. The Uber driver who didn't talk the entire ride. When you hang out outside of work with a co-worker and find out you're very different people but still click. The feeling when you're proposing to your girlfriend. When your girlfriend finally said yes. My least interesting class. When the teacher makes it engaging. And so I still learn. When you're feeling down. But mum comes in with Pringles. The mum has restored my strength. When I put my spare change into the toy vending machines at supermarkets and leave the toy in the slot for kids to find. I'm doing my part. Me telling my mum that I'm gay, not knowing how she would react. Mum telling me she's happy for me and hopes to meet my boyfriend. Boyfriend, I love your body. Me. You get an unknown phone call. You never get calls, so it's probably spam. It's your grandma calling to tell you she loves you. Sorry for talking too much. Thank you for always listening to me. 80 year old me stuck somewhere in a game. My dad. All of my younger self's anxieties. 30 year me. It still hurts, but less. When you meet someone as weird as you. How I go to sleep, knowing I was kind and didn't hurt anyone today. How guys think I'll react if they start crying in front of me. You freaking donkey. How I actually react. Oh dear oh dear. Gorgeous. When your dinner is ready, but your mother lets you finish your online game. You are a good woman. Thank you. Disney princess. Starts singing. Forest. Me sleeping peacefully in my hoodie, knowing that one day I will get a girlfriend and will give it to her. Me looking at how pretty the night sky is. When you stop to let someone walk across the road and they wave back at you to say thanks. Santa gives bad kids coals for Christmas. Kids doing bad things to get their family through the winter. 12 year old me screws up a dish I cooked for my mom's birthday. My mom who eats it anyway. Perfect. Beautiful. Simple. Well crafted. Me acting shocked after a little kid tells me a fact I already knew, so they feel smart and thus encouraging them to continue to share information they find important with people. When you're inactive in a discord server for a while, did a bunch of people still remember you, when you come back? That's the good stuff. Me. My wife. Her unconditional love and support. Me and the boys to our friend who was afraid to come out as trans because she didn't think we would accept her. Don't ever be ashamed of who you are. When you clean your room and your parents arrive after shopping. Surprise mother father. 
If you liked the video, be sure to like and subscribe for your daily dose of memes. Also, be sure to watch previous MemePog episodes. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you back tomorrow.